All right, today I'm going to show you how to easily remote desktop your computer at home or any other computer you want to set it up with with only downloading one piece of software and then and then not allowing uh you don't have to download the other software for the client computer you can ask access it from any computer that has a web browser your computer at home without installing any software on that one computer so go ahead and type log me in it's going to be the first one Firefox is being a pain right now There we go. Okay. I just started currently downloading it, but there's going to be a small box down here. It's going to ask you in your email, password, then click go, and it's going to send you a validated email. Once it does that, then you're going to go ahead and get this download box. It's going to go ahead and download it and install it. Download is not perceived. You can just click here. You download it. Add a computer. That's pretty much it. So once that gets done, you're gonna go ahead and install this. Click agree, next, whatever. And then you're gonna go ahead and run it. I already have it run right now. So once you've done that, it's gonna log out from this. Then all you have to do is point yourself to logmein.com. Point yourself to that, and you're gonna come right here. Go ahead and type in your login. Log me in. It's going to tell you what what computers are running right now and what's online and this is the computer I'm on right now so I'm going to go ahead and open that up you notice it's connected to my computer right now it's going to ask you for your Windows password so go ahead and log into your Windows password and now we can choose to remote control it. We can change settings. Go ahead, remote control. It's going to want to download ActiveX, but you don't need to. As you can see, I'm attempting to remote control the same PC I'm sitting at. Please go to another internet connected device, log in to log me in, remote this PC. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. It's going to look odd because I'm remoting the same PC. As you can see. I'm already on the remote desktop. You won't it won't look like this because I'm remote in the same PC, that's why I'm getting this little error. But you can do a bunch of neat different features. You check your connection, you can send chat, you can network tools, you can do a whiteboard, you can do a chat, you can do a magnifying glass, you can send the control delete keys, change the little resolution, you can go full screen. As you see, now I'm full screen. This is telling me someone's hurry on my computer. Cool. But it's really simple, easy to use, lightweight. And all you have to do is exit out. But that's how you can remote your, uh, your computer at home from a web browser. It'll work for Firefox or an Explorer, pretty much any. You'll want to download plugins or active access. You don't need to. You could simply. Oops, wrong one. Sorry. You could. I have the active X. That's why it looked like that. You could do Mozilla plugin. You could do Java. Java's good too. I haven't tried HTML yet, but I prefer active X. And that's pretty much it. If you want to see any other tutorials or anything, 
send me a message please rate my videos and up to see you guys in a little bit later thanks